Welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. In this video, we are going to evaluate this interesting integral. Integral from 0 to 1, x times blue of 1 over x times fractional part of 1 over x with respect to x. Okay, in a previous video, we also evaluated uh, this integral, integral uh, from 1 to n, uh, x times blue of x times fractional part of x dx. Okay, if you like to watch this video, I will add the link in the description. Okay, uh, now how to evaluate this integral? Okay, uh, at first glance, uh, we know uh, we can apply uh, the substitution. So, the substitution is 1 over x is equal to t. Okay, then uh, 1 over x uh, is equal to t. Now, we know x is equal to 1 over t and differentiate so dx is equal to minus 1 over t square dt okay then uh, we can uh, plug in here now uh, limit we know when x approaches to 0 t approaches to infinity when x approaches to 1 here also 1 okay then here x we know 1 over t so here 1 over t uh, 1 over x we know t so blue of t uh, here 1 over x again we know fractional part of t uh, dx is equal to minus 1 over t square dt okay then uh, we can uh, change uh, this boundaries here minus sign we know uh, here 1 to infinity uh, when we change the limit this minus sign get cancelled and now uh, we have here uh, blue of t so blue of t uh, times now here fractional part of t we know fractional part of t is equal to t minus blue of t over here t square here t so t raised to the 3 power dt okay then uh, we can write uh, this is equal to we know we evaluated uh, this type of integrals uh, in uh, many videos so we know then uh, we should uh, break this limit uh, like uh, 1 to 2 2 to 3 3 to 4 uh, plus uh, so on so we can write now this is equal to uh, using limit limit n approaches to infinity uh, sigma notation sum of k is equal 1 to n minus 1 now here k to k plus 1 okay now if we take uh, 1 uh, instead of k1 now so here we have 1 to 2 then if we take 2 2 to 3 okay uh, i think uh, you got it so then here we know uh, in this uh, limit k to k plus 1 the definition of blue of t we know k so we can write here k here t minus now again blue of t in this limit k to k plus 1 so we know this is this is also equal to k over t raised to the 3 power d t okay then uh, here limit n approaches to infinity sum of k is equal 1 to n minus 1 uh, then this k is a constant so we can write outside of the integral sign and uh, now we can integrate this uh, okay uh, here we know uh, before it we can simplify t get cancelled so 1 over t square k to k plus 1 1 over t square minus then uh, k over t raised to the 3 power d t then we can integrate uh, here limit n approaches to infinity sum of k is equal 1 to n minus 1 and here k now we know uh, integration of 1 over t square uh, minus 1 over t then here minus uh, then plus uh, and this is equal to k over 2 times t square and limit we know uh, k to k plus 1 k to k plus 1 okay then uh, we can apply the limit so here uh, limit n approaches to infinity 
uh, sum of 1 to n minus 1 here we have k and if we apply this limit here we know minus 1 over k plus 1 plus k over 2 times k plus 1 square then uh, we should apply k uh, and subtract so here plus 1 over k uh, minus k over minus k over 2 times k square okay then mm, now we can simplify so here limit n up to just to infinity sum of k is equal 1 to n minus 1 and uh, if you simplify this uh, this is very easy uh, so I think you can simplify this uh, we will have 1 over 2 times k plus 1 square okay then uh, here we can write 1 over 2 outside of the sigma notation so limit n approaches to infinity 1 over 2 sum of uh, now I am going to shift the uh, index like uh, here k is equal here 1 so now I am going to take k is equal 2 to uh, n so uh, we should apply um, instead of k we should plug in k minus 1 so k minus 1 plus 1 we know k square so here k square ok then uh, we can write now this is equal to 1 over 2 now I am going to uh, remove the limit so here we can write uh, I am going to take k is equal 1 to infinity and here but here we have k is equal 2 so now I am going to subtract uh, first term so here 1 over k square we know if we have pl plug in k 1 here 1 over 1 1 so here minus 1 ok then uh, we know this is equal to uh, Riemann zeta function so here we have uh, zeta of 2 minus 1 zeta of 2 minus 1 and we know zeta of 2 is equal to 5 square over 6 uh, minus 1 ok this is the answer for this integral if you like uh, this type of videos uh, please subscribe this channel thank you for watching